Tate Productions. 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 Me writing it when I first wrote it, I literally felt like I was, I just was through with life. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like on some suicide shit. And my thing is, I'm not that type of suicidal where I could really slit my wrist or blow my brains out. Like, you know, but at that time, I just really wish I was dead. I really wish, like, like it, it was a lot of shit going on that I just really wish I was not here. And so I chose to wrote it, uh, chose to write it out, excuse me. Um, but the dope thing about it is when I put it out on Facebook and everything like that, a lot of people were relating to it. And they were like, oh, man, I feel this same way. Oh, don't, you know, don't give up the struggle. Don't, you know, uh, always keep your head up. Like, all this encouraging stuff. Like, I got a lot of negative shit, too. You know, motherfuckers like, oh, just kill yourself already type shit. But a lot of it was positive feedback on some, like, you know, your voice is great. You, uh, you, you're you needed here and all of this stuff like that. So it's like, okay, bam. That's what motherfuckers want to hear. They want to hear that pain. Not not to make them feel a certain type of way, but because they relate to that feeling more. And I said that was going to be the first part in my uh, in my little series of shit that I'm going to release, because pain is going to be the thing that's going to uh, it could either make or break you in, in all in all honesty, pain can either make or break you like. If you deal with the pain and you're able to actually um, absorb the pain and how should I say, like, like literally just just, you know, make the pain fit you, you'll be all right. But most people can't do that. They fall apart. And like I'm a person that might fall apart on that shit. So I had the only thing that makes me mellow the pain out is whenever I write about it or speak about it. You know what I'm saying? So when I speak about the shit, boom, you going to feel that shit regardless because I'm not telling you anything that I didn't think of myself. You know. This project is for people that be going through it, like for real, for real, just because I felt like when I was making it, I was going through it. And uh and and that's the that's the crazy thing is when I did pain I was doing pleasure I was doing all I was doing both really but the more side that I was worried about or the the side that I was worried about the most was the pain side just because I know that's the part of everything you have to give me my phone going off and shit but that's the part that everybody is going to relate to because everybody has pain everybody has pleasures and stuff too you know we'll talk about the pleasure side later but everybody has pleasures and stuff too but that's what i wanted to piggyback off of like there's pain and pleasure and pleasure and pain you know what i'm saying so like when you hear pain what i want you to get is this not even a roller coaster it's it's this downtone. So I go from literally suicide to, okay, I'm here. I'm going to deal with this shit. I'm strong. Everything from first to last track on pain. That's what's going to be displayed. Breathe is one of the tracks I wrote when I was younger. And then I wrote Breathe again when I was younger as well. So, like... And it's funny because a lot of these tracks that I wrote when I was younger come into play now. So like, boom, I'm writing a tr I'm writing a, a, a album or project. Pain. Help is the very first song you're going to get. Then you have breathe and breathe again. And breathe is basically the song where I'm like getting as much off of my chest as possible. See, help is the suicide awareness song to where it's though like, okay, it lets you know I'm feeling this way and this is, this is what I wanna do. 
I'm not going to do it, but this is what I want to do. Then you get to breathe it, breathe again. And it kind of tells you, it gives you an ideal sense of why I feel like that. You know what I'm saying? And I, I even said some shit on a uh, breathe where I was like, um, um, what, what the fuck did I say? I say, um, and I breathe again. Uh, what is the shit? What is the shit, man? Man, I, I've been listening to this. Whole, I ain't even been listening to this whole like that, but I was like, and I breathe again. Fuck your trophy. I came to win. Everyone witness this again. Cause I'm finna put one in your chin. What you're looking at now, nigga, is real. Under one roof, 10 people, no meal. Living for the check, never knowing what's next. I'm depressed, gotta breathe for a sec. Then I take a deep breath. Then I go in and then I'm like, now I'm finna get stupid. Now I'm ruthless, living our life so clueless. We can make a change with a movement. All we gotta do is just do it. I got the knowledge of the true shit. Bam me now before I'm in this bitch finna lose it. Nigga, I'm a nuisance. I'm a rebel, I keep my own rulers. Cause I ain't finna follow nobody else's rules, bitch. Sis, what they teach in the school is the bullshit. Get out here, life can't use it, it's useless. One game, one life, I won't lose it. You don't understand cause you play for amusement. You know what I'm saying? Like, like go ahead in on that bitch you know what I mean and literally like just getting all of that shit off of my chest that's what breathe is about getting everything so that way you can breathe you can exhale you know what I'm saying like word up bro that's all it's about getting all that shit off your chest and definitely after this project is released I got another project already ready to go and in motion well it's not in motion but it's ready to go definitely called pleasure and um i expect this project i really want this project to do a million in streams i want it to but even if it don't do a million in streams pleasure will just because of the groundwork i'm gonna do on pain you know but that's that's one of the futures and then you know with the riser brand and everything you know i got my fucking me yeah, riser shit popping you know what i'm saying fucking mask and shit nigga what the fuck you talk about all that shit you know so uh, that's all it is in the future for me is business and more business i don't care nothing about nothing else really <laughs>